Well, hello there, my fellow Eastlanders. Welcome back to my channel and to a brand new Fallout 76 video. So, in this video, I'll be telling you everything you need to know about the handmade rifle in Fallout 76 as of 2022, how to obtain the weapon itself, the weapon's plan, and its mods. So, before we start, make sure that you sub, the notification on to never miss a video from now on. And without further ado, let us start this video. So, this weapon has two guaranteed physical spawns in the world. The first one is here in your Berkeley Springs. So you want to go ahead and fast travel there. Now a pro tip, if you're quite far from Berkeley Springs, first fast travel to Fort Atlas. As you can see, this is free. And then fast travel to Berkeley Springs from Fort Atlas. This way, you'll save a few caps fast traveling. And in here, first off, let me tell you about this guy as, uh, this is one of the merchants that actually sell the plan for this gun, vendor Graham. Now Graham is a traveling merchant. You don't really see it that often. I've seen him like three times throughout like two or three years that I've been playing this game. So, you know, Graham is a merchant that sells this weapons plan. As you could see, the plan handmade gun. So Graham is one of the merchants that sells this weapons plan. He's a traveling merchant, and I just randomly saw him here, so I thought I'd show it to you. Instead of fast traveling to Berkeley Springs, we could instead fast travel to Bloody Franks. Berkeley Springs is a bit further from Bloody Franks, but if you fast travel here, there might be a few Blood Eagle Raiders in the area, and they will shoot you as soon as you spawn, so if you want to be a bit safer with it, first fast travel to Berkeley Springs and make your way up to Bloody Franks, or just fast travel here. It doesn't really make a difference. I fast travel here. Now, let me show you the route. Remember, there will be a lot of blood eagles in this region, so make sure that you have enough ammo, meds, and stuff on you. So from here, you want to follow where I'm going. Again, there are turrets here that you need to shoot down. There will be a few turrets here, but you want to follow where I'm going. Up these stairs. Up these stairs. Go up all of these stairs. There will be traps here. Make sure that you don't step on them. You see, blood eagles are here, so... Okay, and on this bridge, again, there's a trap here. Be careful about it. I'm just gonna run through it because I don't care. And you still wanna follow where I'm going. There will be a lot of oil canister in there if you wanna pick him up. I'm not really interested. So this guy's here. After you've killed him, another one here, the butcher himself. But after doing that, here as you can see, this is our first handmade rifle. This is a guaranteed spawn, so whenever you hit this place, this must be here because it's a guaranteed spawn. So after picking that up, the next place that you want to fast travel to is again quite close. It's here, the Burroughs North. So let's go ahead and fast travel there. So after fast traveling to the Burroughs, you want to go up this road and here this well this is where we want to open as you can see the boroughs we want to go through here again this place is filled with ghouls so make sure that you have enough ammo and stem packs on you for dealing with them now in here you want to follow exactly where i'm going because the boroughs is a big place you'll easily get lost so follow me step by step when you fast travel here you want to go down and go up here until you reach here. You wanna enter, as you can see, we came through there. You wanna go through here, and just keep on going, keep on going, until you reach here. You wanna go down these stairs, and now enter this room. And so again, as you can see, there are ghouls in this place. I don't really care about them. And until you reach this dead end, here
ready to exchange items. 